Hi guys, bit of a different video today. Um, so I have um, I've got a picture and server, and this is it. <laughs> well, this mess is it. Uh, and I am going to add another map, and it's going to be a building map, purely building. There are no dinos going to spawn on there, but you can take your own dinos. Uh, you, you'll see, it'll kind of work out. Uh, so I've got the island, scorched, club arc, the center, a missa, and now it's uh, Althema. Uh, this is the new map, and I've called it Legoland uh, because it has a crap ton of mods on it. And I've just moved that across. Uh, so yeah, we're probably better off looking in game, but just to have a look. And I'm still messing about with the settings, so I thought I'd just do a little video, uh, mainly for the Patreons. Uh, just to give them a head up as well uh, But this is what I, I'm doing Besides trolling accents and tech <laughs> In between shall we say uh, Right so uh, how many mods have we got We've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19 Oh dear me a lot I <laughs> can't but a lot anyway so there's the different um, building mods um uh decorative mods uh there are some dinos on there but because even though it doesn't spawn there if you transfer with a modded dino and it's not on the map it's just gonna poof so i've had to add them mods in just in case anybody brings that certain dino with them uh the, the, the same on all the maps as well um some of them we've moved them out because of the base game. Uh, they've added them, like the Arc Edition ones, uh, they've added them to, to the base game. So as they've added them to the base game, we've took them out. Um, but that's about it. Right, let's uh, fire up the game and have a look. Okay, so we've fired up the game and we can have a proper look now. So there is 32 mods, holy crap, <laughs> on the server. Uh, some of them aren't really necessary, but again, if if some of the guys bring something that they've made on another map to this one, uh, and it's not the mod's not installed, it's just gonna poof, just gonna disappear. Uh, but this map has got a stack mod. It's got the death one. Uh, it's got the emissor structures, uh, all various different kind of architect structures remastered. Uh, additional structures, the normal stuff, more additional reinforced. Uh, the, these are pretty good ones, the uh, the deco ones. So this is the home deco. Uh, there's a medieval one as well. Obviously the little gym dude. Upgrade station, again, probably not necessary unless you want to upgrade a pick or something, but it's still there. Uh, pull it. I have been using that on uh, the cluster with the boys and i really like that that's that's good that is uh that's going to be helpful for building um transferable element just in case anybody wants to build some tech stuff or you know tech armor and stuff uh garden decor that is like um at, like the assets the trees and stuff in arc so you can basically build yourself a little garden with all the stuff uh emissor editions that is uh for the uh because we've got the um, emissa map and you can tame wyverns on there so you can move the wyverns from every single map so like the island scorch and you can take them anywhere so it's it's like it's essential to have that on every map that you put new uh, again if you don't your, your dino will disappear uh super storage uh, uh aaron longstaff i mean like that guy, that that is amazing. Like the stuff in there is friggin' awesome. I mean, it does good content as well. And now he's got like he's got himself a little little town, little western town with all the little bits and bobs. Quite good. Uh, so you can build yourself a, a western town if you want. Uh, dwarven builds, uh, a, a additional rustic builds, all sorts of kind of things. Oh wait. <laughs> Yeah, there we go. Um, so that is that is pretty good. Uh, they got the medieval one, uh, the map itself, uh, Althema, uh, and uh, the geckos. Uh, we we had a little bit of trouble with the geckos yesterday. We were basically 
they all got deleted <laughs> and everybody was gunning for me i was like man it's not me it's not me it was the, it was the mod maker uh he, he basically did an update and kind of kind of balked him uh and he had to like redo it from the ground up anyway let's uh, jump in and have a look at the map right here we are uh yeah there's a little note up there saying the geckos he had to recreate them damn it <laughs> uh yeah so this is when you you first spawn into the map uh so it's like a crash ship and uh, you've got various different kind of like little treasure things and oh hey oh unfortunate and the loot i must say it's pretty good <laughs> uh so yeah so we've got that 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 uh transfer all that thank you So yeah, let's uh, let's go in creative mode, obviously because it's my server. Uh, uh, cheat. Uh, give create mode. Bomb. Uh, then we could sort of kind of flap and fly about. Now there are no dinos that are going to spawn in here, uh, specifically for the reason for building. So you, it's going to have a lot of uh, people building, doing massive builds. Uh, and you don't want wild dinos like lagging out the server and doing stuff. So there are no fish. There are no... Oh, God. <laughs> there are no fish. There are no flyers. Literally nothing. It is land only. Uh, I kind of made it that way. So, well, you could... You bring everything with you. Uh, so if we go to an obelisk. So let's just have a look. Oh, man. Right. Can we fly? Are we flying? Well, wait for everything kind of coming in. Uh, but the, the landscape looks friggin' awesome. And there are, like, little bits and bobs. There are, there's, uh, like, castles and stuff, which we'll go check out. Right, so I've already been plonking stuff down, like the build stuff. We'll have a look at that, because that is, that is, <laughs> there's a lot. A lot of stuff for you to play with. Holy crap. Right. So, so the idea is that everybody uh right travel to another server so these are my patreon servers so we've got emissa scorched island the center they're all full of animals uh, different things different levels uh the the center uh max level is 600 uh the island has a dino finder so like if you want something like resources or uh, like jellyfish or something, you can find that there. Uh, right, we're not we're not travel anyway, because this character is like a, a throwaway character kind of guy. My main character is on the center with all my stuff. Uh, once I've got it set up, then I'm going to transfer over here. Uh, but yeah, let's let's just have a look at crafting. So we've got all these um, uh, different types of frames or what's that one uh wood glass cable uh oh uh yeah see like you've got all different kind of variants oh my god for tea <laughs> or recycling round i mean like we, we need to put it on something like snap it on something I mean, I'm not really going to build anything. I'm just chucking stuff down. But like this, this is like a wall. Just a wall. <laughs> just demolish a wall. Boom. <laughs> uh, I put the clock on as well. Uh, the clock actually keeps time. So what time are we on? Uh, 8 8.28. So, and if we change the time. Um, oh, like, yeah, let's, let's change it to, I don't know say midnight or something like that yeah there we go look so it's now it's now midnight and uh, the clock changes with it as well um that is part of the uh aaron longstaff build i think it is um so we'll have a look in the the inventory crafting there is an absolute ton of stuff so you've got some of there it is castle stuff in here oh my god keep going you've obviously got your normal stuff 
<laughs> so much. Um, then we've got like, uh, the, that's the medieval stuff. And uh, Vikings. Uh, there is like the decor as well. So I think you have to put like, uh, like a, a bench down and then craft it from that way. Uh, what is that? Oh, the rustic forge. Um, a vacuum cleaner. <laughs> uh, pictures as well. This is the uh, L A L Aaron Long stuff. That's the that's the uh, Western stuff. That's the clock. Uh, hat rails, pictures. Oh man, there is so much to do. Uh, this is the Amissa stuff. Uh, stone. Uh, he does like various different textures and stuff uh hay bales <laughs> you can literally go to town oh uh, what's this one rustic windows so much stained glass windows as well stained glass art yes so well right, let me just change it back today there you go. I cut it out because of my, my clunky typing. <laughs> I was like, J -s -a -t. <laughs> yeah. Um, so the gather rates are extremely generous. So let's go. Let's just go. So we have got this. I know I'm in creative mode, but. Right. Four with this is a standard pit. Oh, wait, is it? Is it a Mastercraft? I think it is, isn't it? It's the Mastercraft pick. All right, okay. So it's a little better. But then again, you've got the upgrade station, what you can do uh, and get stuff as well. So the rates are times 15 harvest. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's because there is so much, like, in, in the packs, like, all the things. You, you're going to need lots of different kinds of materials. Um... Because people say, well, like, what about cementing paste? Why can't... Well, bring snails with you. There are no snails on here. If you want a snail, bring a snail. <laughs> uh, let's fly up again. Uh, let's just have a look at some of these. Holy crap. Like, oh, wait for everything loading. Put that away, sausage. Uh huh. So, I mean, the map itself is, is stunning with all the little bits and bobs. Uh, there's all areas as well, so you've got crystal, and there's some resources specific for this map. Um, I think it's like for crafting uh, magical weapons and stuff. Uh, you need certain types of ore. I've not really looked into it, but I believe it's a thing. Uh, so this map has its own unique resources as well. Uh, it's got all sorts of kind of things. I mean, this is uh, like uh, this is from like aberration like these bits are like the 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 metal structure bits like the rusty bits so that's in there and this map is i think it said about 80 80 percent complete so it's still working on it um but it's absolutely gorgeous absolutely there are little areas as well uh where's that castle i don't know where that castle is it's a it's a huge map as well quite big uh, where can we go i mean what's in here i mean this is this looks like aberration <laughs> it's just look it's got that aberration vibe to it uh so it's like a, an entrance in here but you can access it from the top as well so that's kind of cool uh Let's go over here. It's a bit janky at the minute. I'll say everything's right. Rendering in. Uh, oh, Redwoods area. Again. That's got uh, aberration tunnel. That's that. What's in here? Nowhere? Nothing? <laughs> I mean, you could you could build a little base in there. Just sticking outside of a mountain. Uh, Redwoods area. What's down here? Wait, is that a... I thought that was like some sort of 
kind of thing. I think it's just a normal asset. It's like chained islands as well. It's like an island with uh, chains holding it in the air. Oh, that's the... Uh, that's on the, the world's edge. So that's when you when you ascend, you you see that from, from space. So they've chucked that in there as well. That looks pretty good. All right. Let me see if I can find that castle. Let's let's get that castle. Okay, so here it is. Um it's in these grounds. There's like all these like torches and bits as well. So it's got like the wall all the way around it. And let's just fly up. So yeah, that is a big ass castle kind of a thing. Right, I don't think can we get inside it? I think it's just it's just more like aesthetically for the looks. Uh there is grounds. I don't know what these platforms are for. They're just just here. Uh but yeah, like the castle itself. You can't get in any of these towers. They're just there, taking up room. Just look at. <laughs> Yeah, you can't get you can't get in anything, I don't think. No. It's just there. But I mean there's like all these bits on top of here, there's like a big big grounded area that you could probably build on or chuck something down. Incorporate it into a courtyard. I think there's access to that everywhere. Uh, yeah, that's quite fancy um i think there was some like resources over here as well uh, is that uh is that just normal crystal yeah there we go look, look at that how much crystal do we get from what we found that one block Oh dear. Yeah, it is a bit generous, isn't it? Dab it, Jim. Oh, it's still going. Okay. Uh, don't forget you've got the stack model as well. So, I mean, I know we're in creative mode and we are probably. So that, 600. And it weighs 62. <laughs> uh, 500 rock weighs 25. Uh, yes. And it's, it's still not broke yet. Oh, yeah, there we go. Oh, so we got another another 17 crystal out of that. So you, you're not going to want for a lot, are you? You won't even have to bring a powerful dino. I might even turn it down because that, that is a little bit too ridiculous, if you ask me. <laughs> I mean, I want you to wait for it, not to like, you know what I mean? <laughs> I need some... Right, don't, don't bother with it, Anki. Just get your son a ascendant pick. Boom. That's it. You just one swipe and you've got all your building materials to build to the sky. Um, there are lots of these little things about as well. Like, look, I don't know, like just bits. <laughs> uh, like a dino with like, it's got a sword going through its skull. Uh, and then somebody's built like a shrine around it. Are these? No, these are not harvestable. Uh, again, bits of stuff everywhere. There's like crash spaceships, various different things. Uh, I don't know about caves. I've not really been to have a look inside caves. Oh, have they got minerals here as well? Look, salt. So it's uh, like scorched earth stuff as well. Nice. Uh, what's over here? Another like aberration kind of bit. Seen a lot of these. Oh, cactus. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Wait, is it harvestable? No. It's lying to me. I thought it was cactus for a hot second. I mean, it, it is cactus. It looks like cactus. But it's not. It's fake cactus. Damn it, you lied to me. <laughs> Um, but yeah, I mean, if, I mean, if they've got salt here and stuff, I would presume that there is, uh, scorched resources like cactus and stuff. So you could probably build in that as well. 
If not, you can always go to Scorch and bring stuff with you. That's the thing. Yeah, like little little bridges connecting to islands. I'll say it's just just these little flurries everywhere. And each each area's got something in it. It's like something hidden or a little quirk to it. So we've got a castle. Uh we have that dino over there. Uh Crash spaceship. What is that? I mean, that looks awesome anyway. All right. Let me see if I can find another point of interest. Okay, so we're over this side of the... I'll flip the map up as well. So I'm over this side now. So I've come around the coal bit. Just had a look around there. There are a lot of floating islands around here. Uh, they're just... Just floating. Nothing propped up. There's nothing holding it up. Oh, I don't know about that one. Mind you, what's holding that up? <laughs> uh, again, lots of land on start, top you can build with. Potential areas. And, oh man. The map is so vast as well. Where, where have we... I mean, I've still got all that. I've gone around the outside. And I've, I've not gone further in yet. There's still lots everywhere. I mean, you know, just like just a random thing. Just there it is. Look, oh, all metal on there. All the ground. Yeah. Not red obby. Oh, this is like the volcano area. Again, crap ton of crystals. You'll never want any crystal. A big dino skull. It got rock growing out of it there. Oh. That bone. Like a lot of the Vython died there. <laughs> uh, wait, is that another castle? Or is that the one we've just literally gone right round? I think it is. We've gone round and come back the other way. Uh, there are all these like little platforms as well over here. Um, is that... Is that a layer that get underneath it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what's propping this up. So there's like a, a already ready-made flat piece already for you to build on. Everywhere. <laughs> well, they're everywhere. Little platforms and things. Uh, oh, hello. What's in here? Oh, okay. Little parking garage. Yep. So it's got that aberration vibe all, all the all over it. I've changed the uh, day and night cycle as well. So the days are extremely long, as you can see at the minute. It was like we are on eight oh six, and that is I have not changed it since I put it to eight o'clock. So it's a long, it's a longer time. And uh, this is that chained island, sort of floating, but chained up. It's and it's an entirely flat piece. Apart from this tree in here. Is it destructible? Come on, like get oh hello. Is that a honeybee? No, I think it's just <laughs> I'm gonna say, why would it be there? There are no dinos. Jim, damn it. <laughs> uh that's sort of just I thought it might be a resource you can kinda of harvest. No, nah, they they're fake ones. Like the fake cactus. Uh, okay. Uh, this is their version of the redwoods then, I take it. That is extremely elevated. Wow. Yeah. Oh, excuse me, coming through. Again, lots of floating islands around here. Oh, wait, there's another one of them. Is that the edge of the map? Yeah, I can see. I can just see the, the world border, the thin black line. So that's on the outside. But that, I mean, it looks stunning. 
really does something visual for you to look at holy crap yeah we are way up here <laughs> huh okay right let me go find them uh, resources because there are some resources on here that are specific to this map itself uh no that's not all obviously but yeah i mean just a little bridge little bridge going across the river love it oh yeah look at this bad boy <laughs> oh hello just chilling just chilling out now then there is no dinos on here so this is not actually a dino it's it's like it's an illusion it's an illusion uh it's just i thought what the hell is that doing there uh i thought is it something wrong with it but no it's uh it's just a, a thing just an asset that's been put there but i mean it got me for a second <laughs> i was like god damn look at that anyway all right uh there are lots of say lots of little things like that you just come across them randomly there are so much stuff i'm like uh i've got these like little lanterns i bet they look good at night a uh, little bridge uh like a shadow main there's just chilling there big one um i am still trying to look out for that resource uh anyway moving on wow that looks fancy <laughs> this big ass skull holy crap uh a, a tribute and all so, um so we can transfer wait is this blue obby is this an obelisk uh oh wait a tribute terminal okay but we can't access it huh well we can go to the actual ones but yeah like so this is a uh, another like fake thing that's been put down uh but there's like uh tree platforms or cliff platforms uh that obviously they're not in the game yet but they're here mm, nice kind of cool i'm liking that lovely anyway still not found them assets <laughs> or resources even okay so here we are it's kind of a i don't know it's out of the way well not really out of the way but it's kind of hard to find but when you come in here you've got all those like red uh let's put that on red nodes uh and again there's like some another one of them things here no uh, it's not that so these red rocks give you that ruby metal ingots oh they're quite weighty as well it's all in here all up, all up there let's just have a little fly but you you get like up these stairs to go to different levels as well look is that one no that's a fake one <laughs> it's, but there's plenty about that so yeah so there is uh i don't know if it's like part of the map or something but you're supposed to craft uh magical tools and weapons with this metal um but i don't know Anyway, I think you've got more than enough <laughs> looking at the mods, uh, crafting. Holy crap. Let your creativity flow. Uh, I, it should be fun to come back and see what kind of people's built. Because uh, people get quite creative with the uh, standard uh, stuff that you build. Um, I've seen some really amazing builds as well. All right, guys. Well, there we go. This is the Patreon Lego server uh i've probably still gonna probably add a couple more mods um i will let you know in the patreon post when it becomes live and you should be able to travel with your dinos uh once it's all set up right don't forget to whack a like on it comment and subscribe also left me to do this wave and see you the next one